Even here you can see a lot of working girls hanging around. And we're walking through the Botero Square now and we can already see the first statue, first statues here of the typical like fat statues. We're now on the Botero Square with the typical statues. People are taking pictures everywhere here with the statues. And the sun came out, it's really nice. It's been raining a lot today. Finally, the weather is better. Look, we have all the tourists here. It's much safer than before because when I came here three years ago, it wasn't closed off. So I think it's much better for the tourists. It's a bit sad, it's needed though. Up there we have the metro running right through the center. And this is a pretty interesting building. It was actually built by a Flemish architect, Govart. But apparently the Colombians didn't like his style. And this building was actually built as the governor's house when they wanted to separate church and state. So people didn't like that it looked like a church. That's why they got into a fight. The Belgian architect left Colombia and the locals, they just finished it by building a wall. So that's why it looks pretty ugly on this side, actually. We gotta be honest, it's just a plain wall. Well, the architect of these statues is Fernando Botero, world famous sculptor and painter. And he actually died in September this year probably when you watched this video last year in 2023 so now these statues are even worth more and even more people are coming here because now he died you know an artist gets more famous and more important literally everyone is taking pictures here local families tourists They're selling all kind of touristy stuff here, like sculptures of the sculptures. Look at this dude. He's like a robot. This is Botero Square, full of people now in the sun. Here we have the statues and we can see the whole square is fenced off. It's so different from before. Like this side is totally empty. And then on the other side we have all the shops, all the local sellers. What a difference from before. I don't know if it's good. It's a bit weird. Out of the fence area now. So we're in the kind of mess, the market here. So we're gonna follow Carolina, our guide here. All right. You gotta see everyone is following us. Still looking for some food, but it's only close out around here. So we're right under the metro, and this is the stop Parque Berrio. 